Hello, hello. Welcome to Shading Why. I'm Marilyn, and tonight we have a green theme. Lots and lots of different colors of green, just in case somebody needed something for St. Patty's Day. Um, so, if you haven't been here before, my name's Marilyn, my husband's name's Barry, and we are part-time resellers. We sell on eBay, Etsy, Poshmark, and YouTube. I'll give you a price. If you're interested in something, very simple, send us an email to one shadingy at gmail.com. We'll send you a PayPal invoice. All you have to do is send us a timestamp or a screenshot, your mailing address, shipping us $5 inside the United States under a pound, anything over a pound, or outside the United States is based on where you're located and how much it weighs. So let's just jump right in. I'm going to push everything out to the side. And let's just jump in. Um, here is one of those, uh, I think it's called uh, a bolo tie. Um, goes around the neck. It is, I'm not sure if this is leather, but it is really soft. And it is braided. It has this cool, I'm going to say this is... A Jasper, but let's check it out. Yeah, I'm gonna say it's a Jasper. It is gorgeous. To the slide, it is 26 inches. And then after the slide, it is another four and a half inches. And the center is about an inch and three fourths. So that is really a cool piece. So I'm going to say let's do $25. This one's cool. This is seed beads. Um, these green beads here are losing some of the color. Um, these are stones, tourmaline stones, or a garnet, I mean, not garnet, um, a quartz of some type. It is a um, wrap a bracelet, so any size, um, this will fit, and that's what it looks like. So since it is losing some of the um, color on the faux pearls I'm just gonna say let's do let's do two dollars on that one this is gorgeous this is just going to be a really nice plastic of some type or acrylic it is old and cool it is Really nice, it is stretch. So I'm gonna say, let's do, I love these colors, gorgeous. So I'm gonna say, let's do, it does have some scratches, of course, um, probably from the 60s or 70s. So I'm gonna say, let's do, let's do $10 on that. And this one is fabulous. This is jade. So it looks like it's nephrite jade. Beautiful. It is on this, I believe that's brass. So let's see it's not marked not magnetic and it is a fish hook isn't that gorgeous let's get a length on it it is 24 inches these are spectacular they're hand tied in between Love it. So I'm going to say, let's do, I'm going to say, let's do $60 on these. These are stunning. 
These are really cool. Let's see if there's anything missing. They're not signed. They're missing the bags, but they have these cool um, colors into like a clay. Those are really cool with these leather straps. It is two inches by seven eighths of an inch. So let's do $9. Those are really cool. These are cool too. These are like fabulous. Let's see if these have a name. They have the original backs. They have gunmetal on the back. Let's see if there's anything missing. This seems to be right here separated. So it might need a bit of glue right here to attach that. Since it does have that, I mean, it doesn't take away from it, but um, I'm going to give you a measurement of three inches by about two and three fourths. So let's do let's do six dollars since you need to glue that right there. Those are gorgeous. Love those. Here we have some beautiful Melafiori. I don't see a name. It is slightly magnetic on the toggle clasp. It is seven and a quarter inch isn't that just precious love this i'm gonna say let's do 18 dollars for this this is gorgeous glass love that and here's another one and this one's a toggle clasp also what a pretty toggle clasp um let's see a beautiful pieces not magnetic. Maybe slightly magnetic. Okay, so I'm gonna do the same price on this one. Isn't that just gorgeous? Let's give you a measurement on it. And this one's longer. This one is seven and three fourths. So that will be the same price. These are cool. Um, these are seed beads and um, two um, metallic looking ones. These are great too. These are two and a half inches by an inch and a quarter. So let's say $7. Those are cool. Uh, here's another pair. These are mixed metal. These I love. Then again, I love all jewelry. That's how it's put together on the back. I don't see a name. There you go. These are really cool. I love that green that looks kind of like on copper and it's oxidized. That is really cool. It is two and a half inches by an inch. So these are way cool. So I'm going to say $18 on these. Love those. Was that our last earring? Oh, here's a set. Maybe we'll do these separately in case somebody doesn't want it as a set. All right, this is jadeite, and so are the earrings. Yes. Okay, these are bicone crystal. Look at that center aurora borealis. Ah, that's gorgeous. So I'm gonna do the, um, bracelet first. I'm almost positive 
This is sterling. Stitz. And there's your blue. So let's get you a size on the bracelet. And it's cute how it has this little heart toggle. And it says 925 right there. <laughs> it is seven and a half inches. Isn't that really cute? So I'm going to say on the bracelet, let's do with the um, crystal sterling and um, jade. I'm going to say $22. And if you want just the earrings, which are the um, crystal sterling and jade, I'm going to say $18. So the whole set um, to separately would be 40. So if you buy the whole set together, I'll say 32 for um, the bracelet and the earrings. This is a really cool necklace. It is um, really beautiful. I think they're just glass. So really pretty glass. It is a shepherd's hook. It is 18 inches, so I'm gonna say, let's just do $15. And this one's pretty. Let's see if this one. I think this is just glass, stretch. I'm going to say, let's do $10. Here we have this really cool metal um, clamper bracelet, no name. It is missing a few of the um, seed beads around the flower. It is, as I said, a clamper and it goes around my wrist, but it is tight. So I would say you need to be about a seven for this to fit. But since it's missing some of the beads, I'm going to say, let's just do $2 cool piece. This one's really pretty. It's just glass um, on the back. Love that. It is an inch and a half. So I'm going to say let's just do six dollars. This is, let's see if it tests. It doesn't. It does look like um, a turquoise or a uh, jasper or something. It is a stretch brace uh, ring and it is magnetic. So I'm gonna say let's just do $6. This one is a stretch ring, but check this out. Is that crazy? It's a peacock. I I just think this is a crazy beautiful with the colors. I am not seeing any missing rhinestones, but there is a lot of rhinestones in here. But that is so cool. And it's really tight, but it is a stretch and um really cool let's tell you what it is now right now it is sitting comfortably at about an eight eight and a half but it can be a little smaller or a little bigger and i'm going to say even though it's stretch it's a fabulous so i'm going to say 15 dollars for the peacock let me give you a size on this one it is sitting at about just a six, but it could comfortably go down to about an eight and a half. And this is bars, okay? 
It's signed right here. And these are Jasper and just gorgeous. These are Jasper. These are glass. These are um, quartz and jadeite, I believe. That is gorgeous. And it is a toggle class, so let's get a measurement on it. I love bars pieces. It is eight and, no, sorry. It is seven and three fourths. Isn't that a beautiful green and orange? Love that. Um, I am a seven and a half and it does not fit me. Okay, so those beads are taking up a lot of space. So you need to be about a seven inch wrist for this. And I'm going to say uh, $20 for the bars. Here is a four leaf clover with a little rhinestone in the center. It is a little rhinestone. It is um, enamel on the four leaf clover. It is signed on the back and it says 925J something. It's a small little piece. It is sterling. It is with the bail 7 eighths of an inch by five eighths of an inch and I'm going to say let's do $12 for the four leaf clover. This is gorgeous. This is signed on the back. It says 925 Thailand and then like a symbol that I'm not familiar with but this is I believe um, Peridot Yes, so it's Peridot, that is a real pearl, and it is a pendant. Isn't that gorgeous? It is one and a half inches by an inch and a quarter, and it is layered with the um, sterling and the um, Peridot, and then the Pearl. So I'm going to say $30 on the Peridot Pearl Cross. This one is a Taxco piece. It is malachite and um, a malachite chip inlay with a sterling um, Mayan or Aztec. And it's signed on the back and it says 925. It says Taxco, and then it has additional signs, signatures up here. Really, really cool piece. It is an inch and three eighths by seven eighths of an inch. So for this Taxco piece, I'm going to say $25. Here is an unsigned gold tone brooch that is just a cool glass piece here excellent condition it is two inches by an inch and three-fourths lovely and I'm gonna say let's do $12 for the brooch this piece is really cool this is Mela Fiori and this is a purse um Holder, so this goes on the table, and this is where your purse goes down here. So it isn't sitting on the floor, um, and you don't want your purse ever to sit on the floor. One, it gets dirty. Two, it's bad luck. Not, um, it's it's considered bad luck to put your purse in um, on the floor or bag on the floor, and the reason for that is just an old wise tale as putting your money under your feet. So um, this is a cool piece. So I'm gonna say, let's just do $12 for the 
for the Melifiori purse holder. And our last piece is this cone shell. Very cool with the back black like the Tony Sands in a green. It has the Sheva eye, which symbolizes creation, destruction, spiritual knowledge, and transformation. The um, chain is magnetic. It is 22 inch chain with the, including the bell, two, two and seven eighths by two and one eighth. So um, it is a cool piece. So I'm going to say with that Tony Sands type of back, let's do $12. So there you go. What'd you think? What did you think of our theme video for a change? Tell me in the comments. Definitely, if you saw something, send me an email to one shadingy at gmail.com. We appreciate you spending a little bit of your day with us, and we will see you on the next one. Bye.